previously on a day in the life okay so we got a pound out of it and we're running 571 psi we're going to take another pound a day in the life episode 27 oh where are we going good morning youtube today we've got a 15 ton straight AC split. No, can't spell this morning. Hopefully I can get a little bit of 3901. There we go. Hopefully I can get a little bit of video on it. Take you guys along for the ride. Please drive to highlighted route. Should be interesting. We got, as I understand, a straight air conditioner, split condenser, and uh, gas duct heaters. So we'll see what it looks like when we get there. So this looks like fun. Got some old parts and pieces. I don't know if this is from the scrap man stealing it all or if this is part of the tear out process. I don't know. This looks like a theft problem. Why they would put it all back together, I don't know. And I'm not sure what the deal is with this ducting. It might be duct that they pulled out of the inside when they took the air handlers out. I'm not sure if we've got access or what. No. Okay. I guess we'll give it a minute. See when somebody shows up to let us in. Good Lord. So we got to set it back over here. No. Uh-uh. It's got to go close to the wall. That the front end work out there coming off. Okay, yeah, yeah, I got you. I got you. But to brace this one in, we got to get it brazed in first, stubbed out, and then we we'll slide it back in place. Right. That one's got to come back on it. Over the hole, over the water lines. It got to be back over there like I was saying. Yeah. Okay. Then you got your two hanging heaters that's got to go up here. They used to fan out over there. We got to move these lines before we crush them out. Water line. We got to cut them loose. You got to find where the water shut off. Shut mm -hmm. off the hills and cut it off and drain it. And hey, you supposed to get something to put it back with. Yeah. But it so comes, comes through there, circles all the way around, mm -hmm. picks up that offshoot there, comes all the way back around to the artwork. Where you going? Where you going? Then we got them two big hanging heaters. We got to get up in here. One hundred dollar one over there. But talking about now, we may have to take this piece of front line down right here. Hmm. It's a crossover return. So we may have to take that out of the way, and we may have to pan these joists off because that, those furnaces are saying they got to have a six inch clearance from combustibles. The only way to... You don't have heaters to attach to the top of this line? They ain't got enough power. Okay. They were wanting to... That's what they say they ain't got enough power. I don't... I'm thinking they probably find it. No, that's good. Y'all need to get it. Now we can get it coming this way a little bit more. Back in over here. Ah, son of a bitch. Hey. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. <laughs> got me, my friend. Okay. Yeah. Now, if you can get your back end to go around just a little bit more. All right. How are we going to get uh, enough muscle on this to get it up? I don't know. I pulled back two hundred just there. Which one? Try to pick it up. Over here. Ready? 
Tell you push her.
good? I don't know. Maybe yes, maybe no. Can we see, maybe no? Alright. Straight ahead, fellas. I mean, it'll it may be run into this uh, round duck box, but I mean, if we can come this way just a little bit more, yeah, then I can swing. I should be able to get by this water line over here. Right. All right, ready? Yeah. Hold up. Ready? Yeah. Let's see the line over there. Did we get the wall? Yeah. Yeah, we got the wall. Keep the line. for today is we got the air handlers in place got the refrigerant piping started
we're going to have duct heaters to mount, refrigerant piping to finish, electrical, etc., etc. But I'd say we're not doing too bad for today.